Let's talk about Jonathan Taylor. So as of just so you guys keep up, okay, I'm going to tell you everything, all right? So he's been very disappointing this whole year. Just as of yesterday, all the analysts and doctors, and I was kind of on that board as well, was saying sell low on him, as in get rid of him while you still can. And I was subscribing to that. You know, I was still, I'm not, wasn't fully on board, but I was like, man, this might be the last time to sell low. I told people to sell low on Keenan Allen last week. Like, get rid of Keenan Allen. Like, just get rid of him if you can. Get Trade him. Go get an asset you can start. Go get two assets you can start. Trade him in a package deal. With JT, I was like, man, this might be your last chance to sell low. Now I'm switching to more of a buy low. Now I'm still lukewarm on both ends. I'm not going to hammer this on the table and say buy low on him. But instead of me thinking maybe this is your last chance to sell him, I'm thinking this might be a good time to buy low on him. Now, there's no doubt that the Colts are a mess. They don't have that direct, like we're talking about the fantasy manager we kicked out. They don't have that direction, right? They're just a mediocre team right in the middle. Right like in the middle, like, yep. It's like they're trying to go 500 every year, kind of like the Washington Commanders. Like, what are, what are we trying to do this year? Uh, trying to go 500. Like, no, come on. So they're a mess. They fired Frank Wright. Now, everyone's kind of doubting them, but I'm getting these really strong vibes with this team. Look, they might suck, and they might they might be a mess, and they might be a lot worse, but I'm getting really strong vibes with this Jess Saturday hiring and what this team's doing. I don't think they're going to lay down. Jonathan Taylor's injury was suspected to be a high ankle sprain, yet he put in a couple limited partic uh, practice participations this week, and just today, Thursday, he put in a full participation in practice. Deion Jackson is questionable. Philip Lindsay just got cut. Jonathan Taylor has no injury designation. So and the only other running back on the team is Jordan Wilkins. Son. Yeah, Naheem, oh, that's right. Naheem Hines shipped. So I think this is a buy low. And that's the thing. Like, I, I don't know what's going to happen. Like I said, the Colts could suck more. That's a very likely scenario. They could be a lot more messy. I think the real storyline here is this, though. Frank Wright was really that bad, bro. They really had to. It was not the plan to fire him in the middle. He was really that bad. And. You know, I hate to bring it up, but the guy that we got rid of in the league, he was a good dude. You know, nothing wrong. Everyone got along with him. He was cool. That's Frank Wright. He's a good dude. Everyone respects him and show up. But, bro, you ain't getting it done. Like, it's not happening. You're whack. You're whack. The team's better off without you. And you know what? I can't even wait any longer. We just got to get rid of you midseason. Jim Irsay, I, you know, Jim Irsay is a weirdo whatever, but he really didn't want to do it. And he had to. He had to do it. He had to. He had to get rid of this guy. It was that bad. So uh, we got another guy who's on board. Uh, just traded Taylor. Oh, you traded away Taylor. Oh, you got Eckler, though. Well, that's great. <laughs> yeah, that's that's I don't know how you got that. That's great. If you can get Austin Eckler, trade away Taylor, Garrett Wilson, and Palmer for Eckler and Aqib Lee. The, your opponent must really want to keep Garrett Wilson and Taylor. That's fine. I mean, you got Eckler. That's great. You're probably in win now mode. Keeper League makes a little, puts a little twist on that. So I can see that. But if you were in a redraft to get Eckler, that's great. But for me, right now, I'm leaning more towards the buy low side. And yes, they do have Zach Moss. I'm a certified Zach Moss hater. Don't what do you think him. of the idea that Jeff Saturday, former offensive lineman, kind of brings that? sort of offensive line influence the team. They start running the ball heavy. Do you buy into that at all? Or is that just like a thought that's not really worth? I think, no, I boring? think it's, I think that's what's going to happen. I mean, what else choice do they have? It, okay. I mean, he is their best player on offense still, you know, Jonathan. Taylor. Oh yeah. Jeff <laughs> <That's you. laughs> <Just> Saturday. <laughs> yeah, I, mean, just I was Saturday, like, what? Yeah. I was like, dude, this is really just funny. This dude's about to suit up. I was like, he lost, he lost a lot of weight. Like, Oh God. Could you imagine? Uh, right. Um, 
Yeah, so I mean, the okay. smart yeah, thing that's, to do would be to feed JT. That's much Tom like – what's the opposite? Yeah. They're going to uh, throw as many times as Tom Brady and Mahomes. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not gonna happen either. No, that's I not guess. that. Yeah. That's a that's a zero percent chance. So definitely more uh, a very high chance of what you said. Ground and pound. Use Jonathan Taylor. Old school football. And I like Jeff Saturday. We don't know if he'll be a good coach or not at all. That's true. We don't know. Until we I know. like him, right but he's a good dude though. Like you know what I mean. He's a good leader. Yeah. He's like he's got that. So it's like, hey man, maybe maybe he is a good coach. We'll 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 find out. All right. Um, so JT, yeah. Um, in short, to sum it up, they thought it was a high ankle sprain. Everyone was telling you to sell, uh, to, to sell low on him, get rid of him while you still can. But now it seems like, or they thought it was a high ankle sprain. Now it seems like it's a low ankle sprain and he's good to go. So I'd be more of buying low on JT and the, the coach, the switching of the coach, even though it could get better, uh, it, it could get worse. I don't think it could get much worse. Like however bad yeah. Frank Reich was, like so it was like, that he, bad you're saying? Was yeah, that, yeah, yeah. That's oh, why they oh. fired him right, all like yeah. right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. They had to. Yeah. Like it was that bad. I had to let him go. Yeah.